welcome back and welcome to my new subscribers um i'm excited people are subscribing and that's really cool i'm really happy i appreciate you all anyway here we are again our stuka is still ready to go i have all the uh masking on the canopy ready to roll so i'm going to paint that up then we are going to add the canopy to the cockpit finally and then we will do some put the decals on then do washes um and then put her on her base and she will be done so hold tight here we go. Let's see if we can't finish this girl up today. Be right back. Okay, so I don't know if my masking liquid is old or what, but this ain't working. So I'm going to have to go clean these off and start over. And I'm just going to have to hand paint those rails nice and easy. So, uh, I got to go to the sink. I will be back in a few minutes. Hey, so we, hello, Pixie. We had to go old school here. So I, I spared you the several long, tedious time that it took me to mask all of this off, but we used our, uh, there we go, there's another one. We used our Tiama tape. Uh, I like the I like the six millimeter masking tape. It's very it's it's tacky but not not like horrible. And then um, using an extremely sharp exacto. I mean a brand new blade you just i have you trace out all of the panels it takes some time it takes patience and uh so there's where we're at so let's paint these up and um get this thing going okay be right back
here we are. So, we've added a little bit of stippling to the wings and the uh, wheels, just to bring out so a little bit more metal. Uh, the canopy is on. I used canopy glue, but the fit is terrible. Um, it won't fit. If, if I put it all the way in the right way, it won't fit the centerpiece. If I fit it back so that the centerpiece fits, the rear turret sits badly. So just another little bit of bad fit that this kit has to it. So now I'm going to apply some wash to it. Actually, first, so we're going to use some panel line accent color. I am going to apply the decals, wash, a little bit of dry brush work, and then we will put her on her stand and call it a project. Sound good? Awesome. So let's get on that. Ta-da! There we go. One Stuka dive bomber. Am I happy with it? Me. It's okay. There's a lot of fit issues. There's a lot of um, problems with this specific kit. So, for what it is, it's perfectly fine. It was fun to build. That's all that matters. Did I have fun with it? Absolutely. Was it frustrating at times? Absolutely. Does it matter? Nope. Because it's all in fun. So, there we go. I got her mounted up. She's in a nice steep dive. That's why I left the bomb and it's like dropping. It's getting ready to be thrown forward past the blades. So, kind of give it a little bit of action there. Well, there we go. I'm going to go ahead and uh, get some pictures, some nice, nice shots of it for you. And, uh, as always, like and subscribe. Hit that little bell icon. I guess I'm supposed to say that. 
uh, once again, I appreciate all of my new, or subscribers, new and old. Welcome and thank you. And uh, until next time, keep on modeling. I'll see you all real soon. Stay safe. Have a great damn weekend.